In this video, we'll discover about habits to help you sleep early. When starting your new developing habit of waking up early, you can try out new techniques and habits to help yourself. One thing to keep in mind when you are going to try new techniques to wake up early, not everything will work for you, nor do you have to try everything to make sure you wake up seven sharp. Pick and choose some ideas that you think may work for you. If they don't, then fret not. There are so many more helpful pointers you can find. You may not even need help waking up other than an alarm clock. When it comes to waking up early, you have to keep a positive mindset. Most people who wake up early do wake up optimistic, energetic, and beaming. In order to wake up in such a good mood, you need a positive approach to your mornings, every morning. Optimistic behavior. You need to feel good each morning. As mentioned before, the morning determines how the rest of your day goes. Whether you feel elated or down in the dumps, it's hard, and sometimes you simply don't have control over the mood you wake up in. If the neighbor's dog barks the world awake each morning, including yourself, it's easy to see why you may not wake up in the best of spirits. To conquer this, rather than thinking negatively about the neighbor's dog, think of a positive solution. This may be to either purchase a pair of earmuffs to block out the noise or to beat the dog and wake up a little earlier than his morning ritual. Everything has two sides. In order for you to keep an upbeat balance to your days, you need to understand both of those sides. What is the negative outcome and what is the positive? Most times the negative solution or result is easier to see and commit to. With a little practice though, the positive side can be conquered and when it is, you'll feel much better about yourself and the neighbor's dog. Just as well, when you see how early you've woken up, don't feel disheartened, you should feel better. You've definitely experienced the day where you unconsciously woke up early, saw the time and went right back to sleep. It's all right, everyone loves their sleep. However, when it comes to turning early mornings into a routine, never look at the clock cynically. Look at the time positively. Look at all the time you now have to accomplish everything that needs looking to throughout the day. This brings us to our next point in changing your mental perspective on an early start, and that's planning out the layout of your day. Pre-plan your day. When you start your day, a great way to motivate yourself is by having an agenda. Mornings are admittedly hard, working out, your breakfast, your schedule, your meals, so on and so forth. But what would you do if you'd already planned it all out? Before going to sleep, think about the coming morning. What are you going to eat? Maybe you'll go out for breakfast or make an omelet. Even if it's a vague idea, it's still a method of motivation. You can go further and plan out your entire morning. If it's a work day, then the morning may be monotonic, but if you have a free day ahead of you, make the day fun and interesting with a plan of all the things you can do. Go out for a run or start a project. Try out some new recipes or indulge in some crafting. Anything can spice up a day, and when your days get more exciting, you'll be more driven to start it early. Having a plan for every day may seem timely, but the truth is the only work behind it can be a few hopeful thoughts before bed. Think about how your day today went and try to make tomorrow a better one. If you couldn't see your friends today, see them tomorrow for an early brunch. Today didn't go well and you felt tired in the morning, take a shower the next morning to wake yourself up and feel fresh. If every day isn't repetitive, then you'll feel better about each day. This may feel hard trying to find something new to do every day. Still, it's something to look forward to and actually isn't as hard as you tend to presume. One small change in any day is a good change. Changing something in the morning, for instance, having a different breakfast, going out rather than staying in, leaving the curtains open rather than closed. All are changes you can make with one pre-planned decision that'll make your day better. Hold accountability for not waking up early. If you wake up late, it's your fault. Ignoring the alarm clock, shielding sunlight with your blankets, snoozing for only five more minutes is all on your head. Only you can be held accountable for the time you wake up. 
Think about all the things you didn't do. Without the sunlight, you couldn't go out and enjoy a perhaps wonderful summer day. Brunch with your friends is no longer possible. You may not have the time to take out for yourself now that most of the day is gone. The shrug of your shoulder is not allowed here. The more guilt and responsibility you feel for not committing to your early mornings, the less likely you'll sleep in. Think of all the healthy benefits you miss out on. Waking up with a smile on your face. No black sinking holes darkening your eyes. No lingering sneer from brushing the irritable tangles in your hair. No horrible day hating the partition from you and your bed. There's so much to gain from waking up early and so much to lose from sleeping in. This isn't something to think optimistically about. This time, rather than looking to the better side of the story, you most likely got an extra hour of sleep. Think of all the things you didn't receive. As odd as this may sound, it's okay to feel bad about yourself. It's fine. Everyone does it all the time. They think negatively about their body, their hair, their habits, and you know what they do? They change. If you hate waking up late and truly want to wake up early, then hate your life out at sleeping in. Curse the mornings you didn't wake up early and resent the chances you missed out. All that resentment will become your strongest motivational push, driving to better mornings and healthier, happier days. Dream of waking up like a perfect coffee ad where they seem to love the sun's rays passing through their laced white curtains. It'll happen soon enough. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.